And thank you. We do have some breaking news from overnight to tell you about this morning. Titusville police, they are searching for suspects after a man and woman were shot at a home. Fox 35's Amanda McKenzie has been there all morning and Amanda, both of them were taken to the hospital and sadly they do have life threatening injuries. And I do have an update for you. Uh, the family of the two victims have been gathering here at the site of the shooting, and I was able to speak to a man who says he is the grandfather of one of the victims, a 25-year-old woman. He says that she was shot and killed. He said the two victims were cousins. The other victim who was killed was a 17-year-old boy. He was very emotional about learning about this shooting. And it's a shame that these people are walking around here shooting up these children for whatever reason. I don't care what it's for, drugs or what, I don't care no more. But I'm tired of you killing my family. Leave my family alone. The boy's mother tells me he was inside playing on his PlayStation when he was shot and killed. Now, as you can see, some more family members and neighbors are gathering here in the front yard of this duplex, where if you take a look, you can see there are many bullet holes on the exterior, on the walls, the windows, the car. There's broken glass on the ground. Titusville police say they are investigating the shooting that happened around 10 o'clock last night on 3rd Avenue. Right now, there is no suspect description available. However, this is still a very active investigation, so more information could be released throughout the morning. Right now, anyone with information is encouraged to contact the Titusville Police Department or they can make an anonymous tip through Crime Line. There is a $5,000 reward for information. That phone number is 1 800 423 TIPS. Live in Titusville, Amanda McKenzie, Fox 35 News.